for these I wrapped the hammer with a little plastic and then I put painters tape around it so that when the children paint it won't be on this part of it you know These are all the colors we have. What I decided to do was to do it individually and let them wait. You know, that helps the process. Why? So does this look like, is this waterproof? It's um, just to seal it. Seal the paint? Seal the paint, yeah, uh-huh. So lengthen your hand and lift this and spray now. There you go. And move it as you spray. Yes, there you go. And keep turning the brush, the, um, the hammer, so you know you're doing all the areas. And then at the top, the very, yeah, right there. Mm -hmm. There you go, good job. There you go, and the top. Good job. Beautiful. Good job, bud. Thanks, Haru. If ever you choose to do this kind of activity, it's a big one. Yes, it is a big one. If ever you choose to do this kind of activity with your kiddos, my advice is to get the smaller scissors like these, the disposable ones, even Oriental Trading sell these kind of scissors. So when you use it on like gardening, like trees and, and, and uh, grass and these kind of things, it won't dull your scissors when you're ready to use it for um, paper. Project done, hammer is drying. Thank you. 